I'm Paul Pazolka, Ivy Masters Learning Center and IvyMasters.com. And today we're going to look at the 15th question from Millennium Digital SAT. Test 1, Module 2, number 15, we've got a table. Make sure you understand what's going on in the table before you look at the answer choices. So looking at the title, Employment by Sector in France, the United States, 1800 to 2012. Percent of total employment, and we see agriculture in France goes from 64 to 43 to 32 to three and then we've got manufacturing france services in france and we've got agriculture in the u.s i'm going to mark them both with a number one so you could follow it 64 versus 68 43 versus 41 32 versus 14 seems like they go hand in hand until 1950 and then three to two in 2012. Um, number two manufacturing in france and versus manufacturing in the u.s so i'm going to put number two for both of those let's compare them uh, in 1800, there's a 4% difference, 22 to 18. 1900, 1% difference, 29 to 28. 1950, they're the same. And in 2012, 21 to 18, 3% difference. Now we've got services in France. I'm going to mark the, that with a number three. So service in the U.S., number three. We're going to compare those two. We've got 1400 to 13, difference of one. 28 to 31, difference of three. 35 to 53, a difference of 18. And then uh, 76 to 80, a difference of four. So now we've got it. Let's go to the actual paragraph. Over the past 200 years, the percentage of the population employed in the agricultural sector, so we're talking about our number ones over here, has declined in both France and the United States. So when we check in, in France it's 64 to 43 to 32 to three. In the US, it is 68 to 41 to 14 to 2. Um, while employment and service sector, which also includes jobs in retail, consulting, real estate, etc., have risen. So if we look at services in France, 14 to 28 to 35 to 76. Services in the U.S., 13 to 31 to 53 to 80. It's a good idea to check in with the table as you're reading. However, this transition happened at very different rates in the two countries. This can be seen most clearly by comparing the employment by sector in both countries in which choice most effectively uses data from the table to complete the statement. So we're looking for different rates in the service and the agricultural sectors. So if we look at the agricultural sector, answer choice A is 1900 to 1950. Agriculture from here to here, there was a difference of 11%. In the US, agriculture from here to here is, a, whoops, agriculture, that was manufacturing. I'm gonna erase that. The difference from there to there is 27%. So what's the difference between those differences, which is really gonna get your answer. So we've got a difference of 27 versus a difference of 11. So that's going to be 16. And then if we look at in services in France, we go from 28 to 35. That's a difference of seven. In the U.S. we go from 31 to 53. That's a difference of 22. So it's 22 versus seven. That's a difference of 15. If we add these up, there's a total difference of 31. Let's check out 1800 to 2012. In agriculture, there's a difference of 61 in agriculture in France. In the US, there's a difference of 66. 61 and 66, if we subtracted those, we'd have a difference of five. And if we look at services, 14 to 76, that's a difference of 62. And then eight, uh, 13 to 80, that's a difference of 67. 62 versus 67, that's a difference of 5 as well. Total difference of 10. So that doesn't show different rates. And choice A is in the lead. Uh, answer choice C, 1900 to 2012. So let's go to the other side, 1900, 2012. There's a difference of 40 in the U.S. for agriculture, in uh, France for agriculture. In the U.S., 
41 to 2, it's a difference of 39. 39 versus 40, that's just a difference of 1. And if we look at services from 1900 to 2012, there you've got a difference of 48. And here we've got a difference of... Um, 49, 48 versus 49 is the difference of one. So that's only a total difference of two that's gone. And Android D, 1800 to 1900. So 1800 to 1900 over there, it looks like we've got a difference of 21 for agriculture in France, agriculture in the US, uh, difference of 27, 21, 27, that's difference of six. And then if we looked at it for services, 14 of 28 is a difference of 14. And then 13 to 31 is a difference of 18. 14 to 18, that's a difference of 4. So that's a total difference of 10. So the biggest difference we've got is 31. That's the uh, answer choice A, the most different rates. Thank you for joining us today. If you like this video, click like. You can share it with anyone who has trouble reading charts um, or any data off any graphic. If there's any question you'd like to answer from any official PSAT or SAT or ACT, leave that in the comments. I'd be happy to shoot a video on it. Click subscribe so you don't miss anything and check out our one-minute video on TikTok. Have a great day.